Good morning, campers. It's 10:24 hours on June June 23rd, 2014. Welcome to today's captain's vlog. Batman, I gotta clean my car. Hey, yeah, shit on my car. Huh? Not intentionally, but I'm telling you, the cops are getting more and more motivated these days. So, it's a fabulous Monday morning, and the awesome guys from USF Holland are here. Thank you, sir. And the paint arrived. Thank you. What time you guys open? Huh? Well, usually we open at noon for the public, but shipping can get here at like 10, 10 30. No problem. Got um, here earlier, you guys. Oh, yeah, you found out there ain't nobody here, man. They don't give you like a phone number in there to call? Yeah. It's horrible people. Well, Rust-Oleum doesn't love you like we do. No, That's no, what it is. No, no. Thank you to all the people at Rust-Oleum for the paint. This is just in time. Oh, that's the magic slipper and stuff. Cool. Is that it? Just one pallet? Yeah. Okay. You guys need that? Huh? Oh yeah, we need that bad. What do you do there? Uh, we're a maker space. We're a place for people to come learn about science and technology and build stuff. Yeah. Like, what do you do for fun? What's your hobby? You golf? Okay. You could come here, like if you had an idea for a new type of golf club or something, or if you wanted to tweak your golf clubs or something like that, you could come here and have access to a full wood shop and a metal shop and computer drafting design stuff, just everything. Uh, we've been in business 20 years. We've been here since 2010. We've been waiting for that paint real hard for about a week and a half now. So, it's, oh yeah, that's that navy gray. That's what I needed. We got the navy gray. That's the evil layer gray. You're probably going to want me to sign some damn thing, aren't you? I got it. We got it. Okay. Cool, now the front offices will get done. This is awesome. Cool. We'll be back. Steven's going to kill you. So the art department's coming together. This is the week that the art department really comes into its own. It's going to be cool. But right now, we're wrapping up painting. It's all about painting. We'll be back. So Batman's pulling out the old communications cabling. Uh -huh. The other end of this pipe is the boiler room. Might split off at some point. There's only two wires at that end. There's there's third wire here. So I don't know where the third wire is. That might currently be stopping me. The experience, magician. <laughs> the experience you're having there right now is the reason why I'm not allowed to go back to glory holes. <laughs> Ready, pulling it out of my hand. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, that'd be why I was starting with such a issue. <laughs> Bonus! <laughs> I did. It's like a bad chicken dance there for a minute. <laughs> hey, who's down there? Jerking it doesn't help. You gotta no, tug it easy. Go. I'm gonna double check that in. There might be something. Still okay. Right. <laughs> Stop it. All right, guys. Time is 1,300 hours straight up Romania. Batman. Yeah. Just has to go in the collection and get hung. Oh, that's that's a package. T-shirts unite. Care to take a guess who sent it? Doesn't say. Let me see what it says and then I'll make a guess as to who sent it. I can judge by the level of offensive usually pretty well. That one's rather polite. Here, I'll, I'll put it right there. It has a gift message that says, enjoy the shirt. Does not say who sent it. I got no idea who just sent that. Who? I don't know. You don't know? I don't know either. It just says enjoy the shirt. I enjoy the shirt. I'm curious as hell. Who sent that? It's one of you bastards. I don't know. This one's from Harvey. And those are the one use handcuffs. They are. Yeah. They're they're vicious evils if I handcuffs. That that's just fun. Thank you, Harvey. Ooh! Things I'm gonna do with those. This is from Paul Berikoff. This has your name on it, Moose. It's from the Bits Bits Company, which is way out by the airport. It's Bits! What kind of Bits? For Those the board mill? Oh, are these are board mill Bits? Bits I need for the board. 0.093 thousandths. And they have a lovely catalog for you, too. There you go. A little tiny box from Lin Jiao Chong. No clue who it's from. But it's China. So it's probably either a helicopter part. Yes, it's it's four foot zip ties in that box. I didn't say four foot, I just said zip Oh! 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 That's about another hundred microwave oven. Oh god, man, the things we're gonna do with this. Alright, now we've got a big Carcroft Walton happening, and I think we need to make a giant rectifier for crazy high voltage. I haven't gotten to build a big rectifier in a long time. Uh-oh. That's a big box from Harvey Points. Harvey, what'd you do? It's a box, Harvey. Either for me or you. This big is probably for you. 
It's for you. Check that sexiness out. Those are on the wish list. Yeah. That's hot shit right there. So that's all for Batman. That's for Batman. Yay! Uh, yeah. It's a truing tool for the uh, It dragon. looks kind of like a Wartenberg wheel, but not nearly as much fun. Right. There's that. That's to measure the angle of your dang. And there's a Fowler micrometer. Scott's going to be very happy. Scott's going to be a happy guy. Shrewd's collection value. I went, to, I went to grade school with Scott Fowler. Cool kid. Oh, that's sexy. Look at that. It's a whole set. It's a whole set. That's cool. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh. Huh? Did you I dropped my jawbone in the thing. Oh. Thank you. So according to I have missed that so much. According you. to Harvey, watching you drop it was worth the price of the replacement. Last time you got something with a ribbon on it like that, you wouldn't let us see it. Well, the note mentions Prisco Twister Night, so I'm just going to take a look here, because it's Harvey, and he's Australian, and they're a little touch. Get them! <laughs> Your virgin eyes. Bastard. Okay, he's, he's, they, gift back, they gift box the wrong things. So, Chris, I heard you like zip ties. Take these flex cuffs to your next Crisco Twister night and let me know how it goes from Harvey. This has zip ties in it. <laughs> the flex cuffs were supposed to be gift wrapped. I get it now. Okay. Hey, Batman, we got wow. some more zip ties. Thank you, Harvey. These are totally going in my private collection. Of I'll send fun. you more zip ties when I get back to school. We don't need any more zip ties. We're I have cool. one. I have reversible zip ties. You can undo them without cutting them. Okay, those are useful. Especially if they're about a foot long and wide as hell. If they're about the wider the better. Half inch to three quarter inch wide. Yeah, yeah. The, the, the fat reversible ones are really useful for doing uh, cabling behind the, the thing. Okay, that's not creepy at all. Just so you know. Hi. That's not, that's not creepy at all to be here. Normally, just look out for fuck it. snipers! <laughs> and, yeah, for a big pepper, that's not creepy at all. Thank you, Harvey. Chris, well, this, is going, has this is going in my car and charging right now. Oh, I have missed this hard. So very, very hard. M right, M left, L right. This is this is like the newer model. I had the Jawbone Icon for years. Mr. Kidwell turned me on to it. It'd be really cool if I was smart enough to figure out how to get that out. And uh, as a lot of you saw, being the figment of grace and poise that I am. I dropped it down the drain. I did successfully recover it from the drain. They just don't play well with water. That might have been a thing. It's the era. And I'll let you guys know how it goes. Shouldn't you pronounce it era? He's got a point. He's got a valid point. That doesn't make him right. That just makes him more infuriated. <laughs> that doesn't make him wrong.
We'll be back. No, we won't. We got more. Huh? Winners. What? Oh. We got winners. We got oh, winners. you want to announce? Get up here. Yeah. Get up here. Announce the winners. Oh. Are we yeah. still rolling? Yes. We're still rolling. Boltdepot.com winners. Okay. Who's the winners on the bolt? What did they win for? Okay. First, for the uh, idea of what to do with the 48-inch zip ties. Oh, dear God. <laughs> Seat time productions. They suggested that we take one in and uh, tie it to somebody's drive shaft of their truck. Ooh! Oh. <laughs> oh God, that's a good idea. Just so it's tick tick tick. And then for the no, I mean tick 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 tick. And then the explanation of the sunsets. Uh, that would be Conrad Vandermeer. Okay, what was it? What did he say? Conrad. He was he was able just to get me the explanation of the difference between the two different sunsets, uh, twilight versus true sunset. So what's the what's the explanation? It's in the video. <laughs> It has to do with how far the sun is below the horizon. It's, it's pretty much one. It's there's a whole thing to it, and we should do a Geek Group video on it because yes. it's actually yes. cool. But yes. there's there's civil, nautical, astronomical. There's the golden hour, the blue hour. There, there's, there's a lot, a lot of to it. Yeah. And green flash, awesome. But it, 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 it basically boils down to when you get hit in the face with a baseball. Yes. <laughs> yes, it does. That, that was the way that I learned it best. Yeah. So those are the two winners I had so far. It's really hurting me to listen to this discussion. <laughs> Why? It's the difference between civil twilight and astronomical twilight. You can pretty much ignore nautical twilight because that's just the middle area. Labia. So you, you have... <laughs> We're going to do a Geek Group video on it and you're going to learn all about it. It's going to be cool. Labia. I'm that. That's a totally different explanation video that you really don't want to know about. Alright, you guys have fun. That's I'm mail. Right. We'll see you later. So the painting continues at 1329 hours and everybody is rocking out being productive. Today the goal is to finish all the primer on the ceiling and then tomorrow we're going to actually do the finished white paint on the walls. So all the white you see right now is the Rust-Oleum Zinsser Primer, which is awesome. Absolute best primer there is. And for a lot of the lab, we've just left it white for a long time. Um, and it works just fine. But for this room, we need to have a, a brighter white than just the primer, so we'll actually be using a white Rust-Oleum high gloss paint. He missed the wall today. Very proud. Oh, I've done way worse with a microphone on. Yeah, but you mean to. Well, yeah. She's nice to you, that's the difference. Mm. Do like five more, get it out of your system.
babies <laughs> listening to Earth right now that are so turned on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We can make a video now. I think we just did. <laughs> I know I got my cold open. Hi, hi. Sure you can. Two more two. Whenever you're ready. Yes, ma'am. Sure you can two oh two requested that I do Pachycephalosaurus, and we just happen to have a Pachycephalosaurus. We don't have as much material from Pachycephalosaurus as maybe we would like. We mostly have just skulls and a few extra bones, but we're able to infer, based on the dozens of specimens of a related species... You are going too fast. I wasn't. You, well, you're skipping over yourself. It's like this for about six hours. And he's way better at that than I am. <gasps> oh, gratuitous dog. Dog! Hey, dog! The internet loves you. We have to be quiet. They're shooting a video. So what's the procedure for getting all this stuff in the box? We'll put it in the box. We'll put it in the box. Um, yeah, we'll talk to Batman. Hey, Batman! Okay, Batman's already on it, okay. so it's cool. Right. So, this is Quentin. He's been here for the weekend. You know him, you love him. He's building a radio telescope. And I was dumb enough to say, hey, if you want a couple computers, knock yourself out. So, he grabbed a Gaylord, and he made a pile, and then he made another pile. So, have you got enough computers? Yes. Did you get any laptops? No. Why not? Because I thought I'd be taking too much. Get some, Get some laptops. Go talk to Rocco. Get some laptops. Okay, I can do that right okay. Now. Go, okay. go, run. Okay. Okay. So he's taking some computers. We're going to ship these for him because I really believe in what he's doing. I think it's a really cool thing. He came out and we're going to ship him a Gaylord of stuff. He needs some monitors. He needs some computers. It's totally not landing in our backyard. So, all right, I have to talk to Walt, all city right, commissioner. Here. I'll be back. Oh, in the world of miracles that happened at the Geek Crew, that's a lot of fun. Thank you. Walt came down and met Quentin and just made a donation to his telescope project. Okay, see, this is Grand Rapids. Politicians can be good people, too. Well, so. thank you both. <laughs> All right, best of luck to you guys. Be safe on the way back. Yeah, thank you, you so much. You have fun. It's coming. It's coming. It's thank coming. you so much. <laughs> He'll be back. Mm.